Across the road from the Mandelas this morning, the Quatcher family have just buried their elderly mother, who knew young Nelson as a boy. Two funerals in a small village this weekend. But the mood here is one of celebration of lives well lived. I'm feeling happy by this day because Madiba done a lot for us. We are now in freedom because of Madiba. He fight for us, fought for us. An Air Force salute swings over the nearby town of Mtata. A poor neighborhood assembles for a flavor of Mandela's funeral. Well, some people do. Mandela's party, the ANC, is busy handing out free food. It seems to be the main attraction. Unemployment here is nearly 50 percent. ANC is South Africa. South Africa is ANC. That's Even without Mandela? Even without Mandela, Mandela he, he was just an umbrella, you see. But it doesn't mean that you cannot survive without, without him. But while Mandela's face is on the banknotes, the ANC is losing some ground. Tandika is a teacher and has always voted ANC, but not anymore. Everybody wants to grab something for himself or for herself. It's corrupt. It's a corruption. It's corruption. The country is just corrupt. That's Do you problem. think Nelson Mandela's death will change that? It's going to be worse. It's not easy to assess the impact of a week like this. Perhaps it won't change anything here. And yet this has been an opportunity for South Africans to reflect on Nelson Mandela's legacy and the extent to which this country is living up to it. Andrew Harding, BBC News, Mutata.